up everybody Michigan Ralph in here I'm coming at you with a layout update uh, I'm not sure if I uploaded the last one or not but uh wouldn't really matter because I changed around the track plan a lot but uh, yeah you see I have a lung shape layout now stretching both tables this one's not gonna have any foam on it though because that one has foam on it the unless I like raise the legs on this one then but yeah or I mean lower the legs on that one and uh, maybe raise the legs on that one. I don't really know how it will work. But as you can see, it just wraps around, you know, does all that crap. Back there, that's going to be a uh, either a drywall or cardboard manufacturer. I haven't decided, nor do I really care. It's going to receive the same type of freight cars anyway. It's going to take in gypsum hoppers or at least one... Uh, every uh, couple of days and that'll be that one might pick up a few more but there's not really a whole lot out there and uh, wall box cars so about one hopper and one box car at most and this over here gonna be um, either a grain elevator most likely one um, and uh, And here, this track is going to be the passing siding, which will wrap around over there. It's going to have a small abandoned track that comes off over here, and this, and this is just going to be a little short line. You see, uh, this is their engine track. It used to be a Y here, but, uh, but uh, well, this line just didn't have enough traffic, so they um, abandoned most of it. And uh, since it didn't take any, take any uh, mainline traffic anymore, they didn't, they didn't need the Y. Uh, and then they sold it to the short line. <laughs> uh, so yeah, and then they added the uh, runaround track, which is going to be the outside track. Uh, I haven't gotten the uh, inside track one yet because I'm out of curves right now. But yeah, it'll just uh, stretch beyond the table there. And uh, that or this could be their, their yard lead right here. That still won't be represented, but you know what I mean. And then this will be their main line right here, which will, uh, yeah, as you can see, I uh, kind of kit bashed not one but two bridges. And then it just it goes behind the scene divider there. I might put up a full one once again. I did have one up, but uh, I'm not really sure at the moment. I did chop the last one up, so I'm not really sure how I'm going to do that. But yeah, then uh, as for more industries, I'm not really too sure at the moment. My plan is um, to have a transload, maybe. So uh, we'll just say that those two cars right there are going to there. Then, uh, well, that. All right, so this takes place in the early 80s to mid 80s, whenever SD45s are still used, because, you know... Well, speaking of the SD45 here, I actually sun bleached it kind of off uh, actual prototype photos of that unit. Though not fully, it's just like you can see like spots, whereas on the actual unit it was just a lot of streaks. Alright, as uh, anyway, back to the operational part. Um, okay, so we'll just say that the, that the uh, IC box car then. Uh, that hopper will be bound for the grain elevator. Then uh, the IC box car, those two box cars, maybe just all the box cars other than well one bound for the, the uh, whatever manufacturer over there will go to the interchange point. My plan is the short line actually only has two customers, maybe just one maybe. Well, one and a transload customer. I'm kind of basing it off the West Michigan Railroad. Who only actually has like two switches on its whole main line. Which is like five to six miles between Hartford, Michigan and uh, halfway between there and Lawrence, Michigan, I believe. I don't know. They only have two switches and uh, they are changed with CSX. It's essentially just this. Essentially, minus the engine track, they don't even have one. Well, they do, but they store them, like, on the main line. It's essentially this. Then this track here would actually end right about there, and it's a transload customer. And there's no bridge, of course, because it's right in the middle of downtown. 
if you look at it on Google Maps, it's uh, right there. CSX would uh, come in off a crossover and drop cars there, or maybe over here. I'm not. I'm not really sure on what this is. If we're talking about the West Michigan Railroad, I just saw Hoppers there, so I'd presume it's a transload. And either way, uh, whatever goes onto the railroad ends up in a truck somehow because they start pants in logistics, which is a trucking company. I know there is a transload customer somewhere on the route because uh, they uh, do take in tank cars full of stuff and uh, distrib distribute them somehow. I don't know how though. They store them on there too, as all short lines do. But yeah, of course, since uh, what I'm doing is based in the in both Michigan and Indiana. Well, we'll just say that this part over here is the Indiana part. Then that right there is the state line, so it's not gonna be modeled in any way. It's probably just gonna be kept plywood. Then I'll put a grass mat on here, get rid of the mess in the middle. And then over here, this will all just be uh, Michigan, I guess. There's a bit more hills up there. So, uh, yeah. Uh, I also have another 4 by 8 sheet, but I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that at the moment. I'm thinking I'll turn that into my uh, end scale layout when I get a f when I get some more room. I plan on putting another 4 by 8 table raised up a little bit above this one, then putting some lighting under it. <laughs> I'm also probably going to add some spurs over here, but maybe just the grain elevator or... Um, uh, oh wait, right, 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 there's the transload cut, oh wait, no, I can just have that on the shoreline, I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do over here, but I, but I'm probably gonna put a lumber company, maybe, give me, get a center beam or two, so I can run it with the, uh, high cube there, and maybe with the, uh, other modern crap right there, you know, I think that down there is a, nah, never mind, but I expect to see BN wax car as well as uh, these two at a lumber company since well they're all box cars I know for sure the 60 foots are taken by lumber companies because uh, my local one does that but uh yeah that's really all it is for this layout I guess I don't know Michigan Railfan out